All right, uh, Queen and Handyman here. <laughs> We're gonna assemble some outdoor teak furniture. Uh, so this is gonna be a chair from this company. I can't say it, I can't pronounce it. It's dead from Denmark. It's gotta be great if it's from Denmark, right? So anyway, um, they just give us these tools. This, I mean, tool, I mean, these are, these are the parts. Uh, there's like six parts in here to assemble this entire chair. I love how these guys like can do this with only, you know, five parts. That's pretty amazing. Anyway, uh, let's see what we can do. All right. So the first thing we want to do is figure everything out. So we want to take these apart. Okay. So we got these pieces here. These are going to go into the chair here. Like going to go right into these holes on the sides. These are the sides of the chair. Okay. Two. I'm just feeding them in by hand here, just to kind of just get it started. Okay, going on to the other side. And then the last one. Brilliant. Then, let's see. Screwdriver, always, again, always do these by hand. Um, if you use a, uh, a screwdriver, sorry, if you use a power drill, um, you have a chance of just ripping these right out of the, of the chair and you don't wanna do that. So again, just hand tighten with your screwdriver. It's all you need. Okay. Now the tricky part is assembling this thing, right? So this is the back of the chair. Okay, the back of the chair. And this is the seat of the chair. This is the front of the chair. Okay, so I want to put this sucker together. So we're gonna lay that down. And then we are going to put these pieces together. our back of the chair. Okay, so this will this is gonna slide into this and then that's gonna slide into that. And it's all gonna be lovely. Kind of just rough fitting it together here. So we got those two pieces together <coughs> and great. I always do that. I always put stuff together first. Okay. So anyway, we've got these little pieces here and they need to go into the grooves. So these are going to drop in and there's a little line on these things. I don't know if you can see it. There's a line. That line has to be right in the center of the bolt where it comes in. It's difficult to do this. It's not super easy. Um, it just popped right out.
Yeah, not, it's not, not easy, is it? those in and what I'm gonna do now there's one piece that goes in the top there's one bolt here that goes up into the top here gotta line it all up try to look for the hole Okay, sorry, I had to pause the video there because I'd already assembled one chair and uh, I was like, you know what, I'm going to just you know do one chair by myself and then I'm going to video the second one, thinking that the second one was going to be easier than the first one. That's not the case. Uh, <laughs> this was <laughs> it's not easy. Um, the top board, the top piece where it connects into the chair up here um, was not lining up. Oh, I can't see it. There you go. This piece here. Uh, there you go was not lining up with this so I literally had to like you know manhandle it to get it aligned up um, but I did I got it um, it was just you know I didn't want to see you I didn't want you guys to see me uh, wrestling uh, with a chair that's a little embarrassing but anyway um, I'm gonna try to put the other other side on so you can see how that is and hopefully this side is gonna go easier okay so, we've got our pieces here, you know, on the bottom. Those are going to slide in. Again, this thing is not going to be cool with me. See, I don't want to take a hammer to it because I'm afraid of, like, denting the wood or or, you know, breaking something. So I want to do it as best I can without doing any damage here. Okay, let's try this again. All right, I got it. So, can't hammer it on the way because you got to install these pieces okay so I'm just gonna set these oh, you can't see anything it's so difficult to see I'm gonna set these pieces in okay there's one and then one on the top Those are in and now I'm just gonna use there's a set screw here that screws into the piece you just can't see anything I'm trying it's this thing is so sorry about that okay so it's gotta get it in there right? Bottom. 
Again, these little pieces here going into the hold the leg together, hold the pin in place, tighten it down. trouble with last time is the top of assembling that into place. So we've got our bolt here. Make it go there. So we got our bolt going to the top. And this one's slightly better. Lines up. I'm gonna use my drill here for a quick second. I know I said don't use the drill, but we're just gonna get it a little bit close to it and then we'll hand tighten it on the on the final. So we're just gonna do a couple of a couple of turns and then finish off by hand. So we know where the bottom of that is, bottom of the where it stops. A couple of turns here. Okay, now I'm doing the uh, dining room table or exterior table, and this one looks, this is super easy to do. Um, it's got four legs, um, some, some, some nuts and bolts, uh, and a washer, uh, and then a tightening tool. Super easy. So let's do, let's do this one. doing it in the box so I don't scratch anything so you just you know open up the sides there and then uh, the bolts are already on the piece of wood so we'll just take those off washers insert through washer nut Uh, it comes with a tool, um, they provide it for you, that's nice, it's exact size, it saves you from trying to go find something, um, usually they're metric as well, so most people don't have a metric wrench lying around. Uh, I also recommend, um, you know, when you're done building something that, you know, you tape it to the underside, or, you know, tape it keep it close to the device because you know, over time stuff loosens up and you're like you want to tighten it and you're like where the heck is that wrench uh, and it's really cool if it's just you know underneath the table somewhere or hanging hanging somewhere close and convenient um, that makes it nice and easy again hand tighten no no tools no no ratchet wrench or anything like that, just hand tighten. Again, this is the plank bench. Um, this is all. These are all plank, plank chairs, plank bench, plank, plank table. Um, nice wood, cheap. Nice finish. Um, again, the, the chairs and the bench uh, difficult to put together. Um, they're well made, but um, just kind of like trying to like fit everything, and you know. It was a lot of manhandling and then I had to have the homeowner help me on the bench it was just too big um, for me to try to put everything together and, and do it by myself um, 
but it came out really, really well. Um, Homer's super happy. I'm very excited for them. It's beautiful. Um, and yeah, all done.